Very emotional on both sides in this case. Diana Gill died about two and a half years ago, and during those two years, her family has been waiting for the person responsible to admit what she did, and today they're getting some justice. Yvette Barsuglia was surrounded by her family as she wiped away tears inside that St. Lucie County courtroom Monday afternoon. Also inside that courtroom were well, the members of the victim, Diana Gill's family. Barsuglia told the judge on the morning of April 7, 2014, she was on her way to work when she was hit by what she thought was a white truck as she merged onto the highway and had no idea she had hit someone before getting on that highway. I am so truly sorry. I lost a child and I know that pain. I have two daughters of my own and if anything were to happen to them, I would die. So I know the pain that they're feeling and I am just so, so sorry. Gill was walking to her school bus stop when she was hit. The 18-year-old uh, died a week later from her injuries. Her family members say their lives have been changed forever. She killed Diana. She deserves to pay for her life. It was a young life, an 18-year-old girl, full of health, full of joy, full of love, and she took that away from us, as well as her life. So we are very happy, very pleased with the outcome of the, of the sentencing today. Now, the state asked for 25 years. They say that Barsuglia was not remorseful at the time of the accident, and especially when she was being interviewed by detectives. Uh, now, defense, though, well, they asked for 12 months. Reporting live in the newsroom, Angela Rosier, WPBF 25 News.